All right, so I seen the MJF promo and I was proven right. This thing is a huge work and that is a good thing. You are a complete moron and very naive if you think this is real. That means, damn, TK and MJF are doing a great job on working you. Like I said, they are working you. They're not working me. But I'm loving where this thing is going. This will turn MJF into the company's biggest fucking baby face. This storyline will turn MJF into a face. And he will be the face of the company very soon because he will be a face. He said everything that I say in all of my videos, which is kind of weird, but it was great shit. I like I like that he said that Tony Khan is basically a damn fan in the audience who's rich, who owns a company. That's what he is. I, I say that all the time. That's what he is. But if you think this is real and he's going to the WWE, bro, you are insane. Do you see how talented that guy is? You think he's gonna? Do you think TK would just let him just walk away, bro? This is a huge work. The type of shit that he was saying, you don't allow a guy who's leaving to say all that shit. He was burying Tony Khan. He was burying the whole company. He was burying all the guys on the on the fucking roster and the fans. Why would TK not sign off on that? Why would he just allow him to say all that bullshit if he didn't sign off on that? Dude, Tony Khan said with his own mouth that he fucking proofreads everybody's promo. He always knows what they're going to say before they grab a fucking microphone. In fact, he punished Max Caster for that. Remember that? Remember he had those rape comments about lacrosse? And Tony Khan fucking threw him under the bus because he said, Tony Khan said that he didn't sign off on that damn promo. And then after that, he said, from now on, he, he's going to sign off on all of Max Caster's promos. He's, he's going to proofread them now. He's going to proofread all his raps. That's how hands-on Tony Khan is with your fucking mouth on TV, TNT, TBS. This is a cable station. Tony Khan is not going to allow you to say shit that he is not going to allow you to say. Everything that MJF said, he ran it past Tony Khan. Why, why wouldn't he? Are you kidding me? You can't do You can't let somebody just say anything you want. Of course, he signed off on all that shit, but this is where they should work on it. They should go all the way. Because this is going to lead to Tony Khan becoming an on-screen character. He will be like Eric Bischoff. He will be like Vince McMahon. And MJF will be like Brian Pillman. And Stone Cold Steve Austin. They should go all the way. They should have MJF um, get fired. They should fire him, right? Fire him in kayfabe. Fire his ass. Have him show up to Ring of Honor. <laughs> Have him show up to GCW. Have him show up to MLW. Have him show up to New Japan Pro Wrestling. Have him act like he's a free agent. In fact, this is what they should. This this is what MJF should do. He should go to Titan Towers. <laughs> he should go to Titan Towers and take a photo of him next to the WWE sign. Just to troll the fans. Do it. Go to go to Connecticut. Go to the fucking building. Take a picture of the building and while you are in front of it. That's what MJS should do. Just to make people think he's leaving and he's really gonna sign there. Go all the way. Make people believe you are leaving. That's where this storyline is headed. And I think TK will be the heel. I'm sorry, he will be the heel. And MJF will be the face. That's where this is heading. They are working everybody. But it's a good thing. 
this will be one of this will be AEW's greatest storyline of all time, and this will turn MJF into possibly the biggest face in all of wrestling. That's how over he is once he grabs the microphone. He has the potential to be the world's greatest face. He has that potential with this fucking storyline. If he keeps, you know, trying to rely on a sympathy of him, all TK does is bring in all these ex WWE guys to take to take all my damn money in my damn TV time. That will get him sympathy from the audience because they think he's better than Adam Cole and Dean Ambrose and all these guys. That will bring MJF some more sympathy as a as a face. Because people will think, okay, he deserves to make more money. TK is going to have to pay him. So this this will be a two-year build, really. This will turn MJF to the biggest face in all of wrestling. But this promo was great. He sounded exactly like me, which was kind of weird. That's why I fucking liked it. I'm like, damn, is that how I sound? <laughs> when I'm yelling <laughs> in my video like damn so that's how I sound that's how I would sound if I had a microphone on TV cutting promos and I'm like wow I sound that angry damn that's cool shit I'm like wow so that's how I would sound if I had a microphone in, in AW just saying anything I want to that's how I would sound wow I sound pretty damn badass I said, I'm, I'm, I'm done 